Hi everybody, welcome to another video for a Mexican species, my only Mexican species, the T Tilto Cow Vagins, formerly known as the Brachypalma Vagins, um, common name the Mexican Red Rump, it's indigenous to Central America slash Mexico, uh, its habitat is the savanna scrubland, temperature is about 70 to 85 Fahrenheit, which is about 21.1 to 29.4 Celsius. Humidity is around 65 to 80% humidity. I keep my species around 25 to 26 Celsius. And my humidity, I keep around 65 to 70. I wet um, only one side of the enclosure, which is this side here where the water dishes, and the rest of it I keep dry. Um, substrate, I use a compost with leaf litter, a water dish. Um, it's a medium species of growth. Adult size is around 15.424 centimetres. So a solid 6 inches. Temperament, it's a New World terrestrial species. And they can have, they can have moose swings. I'm not have no moose swings from this girl, but they can potentially have moose swings. One minute you might think um your vagins is chill, next minute it all flip cares or Rear up in a fret posture and try and bite you, so they are prone to moose swings, but nothing from this girl yet. Um, it's a very attractive spider with a velvet black body with red ruby hairs on the abdomen. A beautiful, a beautiful contrast. Um, they're very hardy species, you can't go wrong with one of these. Um, definitely recommend for an intermediate keeper. Or potentially it is as a beginner, as long as you know what you're doing. But nonetheless, a stunning terrestrial Mexican species. If you can deal with a tarantula with mood swings, then I highly suggest you look at the vagins. Like I said, black velvet body, lovely red hairs on the abdomen. Obviously it's an terrestrial new world species you can see my girls currently walking around slow <laughs> but don't let just because she's walking around this slow don't let it fool you <laughs> they are prone to moose swings nonetheless there's a um, simple and easy care video for the Tito cow vagins formerly known as the brachypalma vagins my girls on a diet as you can see the size of her abdomen compared to a carapace just goes on a diet for now, before she melts out again. Medium growth species, stunning little looking spider. Highly recommend getting one in your collection. Anyways, as always, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this care video. And feel free to rate, subscribe, comment, and don't forget, there's no need to be scared of a spider. <laughs>